So you might be in a situation where you're wanting to go ahead and basically turn off the predictive or inline sentence finished you know, options that you have within your iPhone. Now, a lot of people don't like these because apparently they're not as good. So just keep that in mind. It's a very basic process of actually turning them off. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is you want to hop inside of your settings application. Now, when you do that, you'll come into a page that looks like this. Now, what you're going to want to do here is you basically want to scroll down until you see a little option that says general. So tap into your general option right there, and then you'll come into this page. Now, what you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and scroll over until you see a little option that says keyboard. So you can see keyboard is basically like right here. So what you're going to want to do is you want to tap on that keyboard option, and this next page is going to come up. Now, within here, you're going to see a lot of different things that come up, text replacement, you know, one-handed keyboard, so many other things. But right here, you're going to see some things that say like predictive. So this is basically what you want to go ahead and disable. You want to disable this predictive option because that is essentially what's going to happen is it's going to start predicting random things and you probably don't want that happening. So what you want to do is you want to go and turn off predictive. And then what's going to happen here is that whenever you start actually typing and texting other people or doing whatever, it's going to basically not suggest as much when you're going through and actually typing. So before you may actually have some like sort of like, you know, sentence finishes that may suggest sentences and stuff as you go through but you can go ahead and disable that by doing this. Now, if you want to keep this back on, you can just go back, type in predictive, and you can see that this next panel comes up and it will start actually predicting text and things like that for you as you're actually typing. So that is an option that you basically have. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.